It was once part of the Grand Trunk Railroad, built in the 1800s. Last passenger train pulled out of here in the 1950s, and now Rails is a popular restaurant. This building is considered the Ellis Island of the Lewiston Auburn area. Um, when it, back in the early 40s, 50s, when it was a mill town, a lot of the French Canadians came through this train station to come to work and they migrated through this area. We like to do a lot of things that people eat, but do it a little bit differently. So, all right, now we're down in the uh, kitchen with Chef John Purcell. And what are you going to make for us again today? Our baked haddock dish. Baked haddock. Yeah. And everybody loves baked haddock. Uh, it seems to be our best seller. Yeah, this has a twist. It's got this for blank sauce. Yeah which is white wine, champagne vinegar, lemon juice, each about an ounce. Hold it up to the camera. Okay. Some capers, yep. about an ounce of those. And then a little bit of fresh diced shallot. Put that in the pan, get that reducing down. And then the next thing, will be to slightly toast some breadcrumbs in butter to top the haddock with. Once that butter gets melted, which it is mostly, take some breadcrumbs and some mixed herbs. And this is parsley, rosemary, and thyme. Mix that all up there. Fold the end under so that each end is about the same thickness. That way it cooks evenly all the way through. And then we'll bread the haddock. Uh, panko, these are, or? yep, these are actually Japanese panko crumbs. Just a little slice of lemon to infuse a little lemon flavor into the fish itself. And that'll go in the oven for roughly nine to 10 minutes. The sauce will be go on right at the end. Oh, yeah. I put it right over the fish so that it soaks right into those crumbs and a little bit in the fish. All the butter, when it's cooling down, mm -hmm. the fat from the butter congeals. You see how it gets a little yeah. thicker? Yeah. Uh, it looks delicious. I can't wait to try, especially the Beurblanc sauce. Mmm. Buttery, so good. And you know when I have two bites, and three bites, I like it. We're going to have the recipe for you on our website. And don't forget to check our mobile app too. All right?